If you're a new tenure track faculty member, I have some advice for you. For context, I'm a tenured associate professor at an R2 research institution. You might be wondering why I'm congratulating you already. It's because the hardest part of getting tenure is getting the tenure tra track job. And now that I've been on search committees and seen the whole process behind the selection and getting approval and getting a hire approved, it's huge. You have arrived. So congratulations. But now that you have the tenure track job, I'm guessing you probably actually want to get tenure. You go up for tenure, you need to show that you have followed the guidelines and you cannot show that if you don't know what the guidelines are. So know what they are, prioritize accordingly. Are only certain journals allowed to be shown as evidence of dissemination or other kinds of journals not respected as much? Do you need certain kinds of peer reviewed work? Do you need to have your teaching evaluated by your peers, by your chair, by the instructional uh, development specialist at your school? Know these things and follow them. For things that aren't a priority, work to rule. This is an idea that you find out what is required of you and you do that, but do not go above and beyond. If it's not something that's going to be fulfilling for you or in, it's not something that's going to help your tenure case, just do the minimum. Document, document, document. Remember, you are putting together evidence that you deserve legal protection in your job. You need to show evidence. If you help a colleague with their survey, if you allow somebody to come to your house and practice their research instrument with your kids, uh, I've done that. Make sure you get an email and you save that email and you put it in your file. This is part of knowing your tenure guidelines, but play it safe until you have tenure. For example, now that I have tenure, I'm publishing a lot more in Diamond Open Access Journals because that follows my value system. But before I had tenure, I focused on publishing in journals with conventional metrics to show their quality. And remember, work won't love you back. Have something that makes you happy, have some kind of identity, something that you can hold on to that is outside of work that makes you happy. It's so important for your health and well-being, and you don't want to get to tenure and burnout. Anyway, have a great year and I wish you all well.